Did you know that according to statistics, 84% of women attest to having a toxic personality friend at some point in their lives? Although this study was focused on women, toxic friendships do not affect only female folks. Everyone has unwholesome people around them. However, if you want to be better in life, you must avoid these people entirely. In this video, I will show you 10 types of people to completely avoid. If you are new here, consider subscribing to this channel for more awesome videos. 1. The Down Tucker Jeff, you can't. It's impossible. You don't have enough funds. The economy is down. You will never succeed. Your products are new. People won't patronize you, etc. Do you have people who say such words to you? These kinds of statements destroy dreams that failure ever will. They trigger negativity in your life and make you begin to doubt yourself. Hence, if such people are in your life, you must endeavor to end ties with them ultimately. Down talkers never believe in you. No matter how much you try to convince them, they will always give an excuse to doubt you and your ideas. Even though you assume that you are thick skin and that negative words cannot affect you, you still need to avoid them. Reason being that, although you may be able to ignore those negative words consciously, your subconscious mind picks them up and stores them, and over time, it brings them back to you as negative thoughts which may destroy your zeal. So the best thing to do is cut down tuckers entirely from your life the moment you notice them. 2. The Critic We all need someone who can offer well-reasoned and factual opinions about our behavior, career, and life in general. Even if some of the views may be negative, these individuals are not negative people. They only offer constructive criticisms which may sometimes appear in an unfavorable light. However, if a person continually criticizes you, no matter what you do, it becomes a big problem. It is even more suspicious if this person questions your ideas without concrete facts. When a person continuously attacks your viewpoints, you may begin to reason that means you can't do anything right. That feeling will undoubtedly diminish your self-esteem, especially if you value their opinions. The critic will stylishly insult you whenever they are not satisfied with something. And the truth is, nothing you do will ever satisfy them. Also, most critics do not know how to differentiate between a person and an act. They criticize a person instead of the behavior. Check if some of the following sound familiar. What have you done this time? You always mess things up. You are capable of. If yes, then you should altogether avoid these people. People who care about you won't take any opportunity to belittle you so that they can feel better about themselves. 3. The Manipulator One of the most familiar, unhealthy personality traits identified as manipulators. Sadly, we all have had such type of people in our lives who manipulators, and even more painful, they might be challenging to identify. A manipulator possesses different kinds of attitudes which they use. Depending on the situation, they pull time and energy out of your life behind the facade of friendship. They can be complex to deal with because they are usually a charming and friendly treat. They take their time to study you, so they know a lot of things about you. What you like, what makes you happy, what you think is funny, etc. You may feel that they pay attention to you because they like you or care about you. But the fact is that they only use this information as part of a secret plan. Because manipulators are parasitic, they take but do not give. Their goal is usually direct at getting something from you. Manipulators are a tricky and toxic set of people. Hence, immediately you observe such trait in a person. Discard them. Try to avoid such toxic people. Otherwise, you will end up spending a lot of energy in confronting them. 4. Self-absorbed individuals Self-absorbed people believe in me and not we. Whatever they do, think or say, is always surrounding them. They feel that the world revolves only around them, so everything is still about themselves. Everyone must care for themselves, but self-absorbed people go way beyond that. Such types of toxic people can be identified by personality traits like caring only about themselves and their activities. They don't show interest in the rest of the world. Their own emotions, feelings, actions, comfort, needs, etc. are always being prioritized, at times, at the expense of other people. Having these people around is not healthy because they are inconsiderate and you cannot trust them to be there for you in difficult times. Hence, it is better to avoid them. 5. The Control Freak These individuals are one of the worst on this list because, while other toxic people may do what they do to satisfy themselves, the control freak wants to pin you down on purpose. They take pleasure of intentionally holding you back from achieving your dreams. Maybe they recognize your ability and want to use you for their gain. Or they are naturally thrilled by making others do what they want or think they know how to live your life better than you do. Regardless of their emotions, they try to dictate what you do with your life. 
resorting to manipulation, oppression or intimidation to make you act within a certain way. Having a control freak in your life is like a people being ruled by an authoritarian or under a military regime. You have no choice. A control freak is streaky. They will make you seem like they want the best for you. When all they do is satisfy their urge to be in charge, they'll get to know you well, but they'll use what they know to control you rather than to help you find your way. Stay away from the control freak by any means necessary or you will soon find yourself enslaved. You control you and no one else gets to do that. 6. The Twisters Certain toxic people have bad intentions that generally derive satisfaction from the pain and misery of others. This set of individuals are called the Twisters. They are either out to hurt you, to make you feel bad, or to get something from you. Otherwise, they have no interest in you. The only good thing about this type is that you can spot their intentions quickly, which makes it that much faster to get them out of your life. But then again, they may attempt to manipulate you into letting them into your life again. They will always use words like, I don't know what came over me. I think I had a mental breakdown. To avoid such people from coming back to you with such manipulative excuses, you must cut them off completely. 7. Users Some people will remember you when they want something, or they are in trouble. Do you have that one friend whose calls are solely aimed at seeking help, and when everything is sorted out, they forget you? Well, if you have this kind of people in your life, then learn to avoid them. Friendship is all about neutrality and reciprocity. Going out of your way to assist someone who will not even lift a pin for you is inappropriate because you deserve better. Even though we should not help people with the mind of being helped in return, it is only appropriate that someone you care about should be able to walk some miles for your sake. Learn to know which person is using you and leave them all together. 8. People who want to be you Stay away from the ones who want to be you. Now, this is not in any way disregarding the role of modeling or mentorship. We all have role models, people we want to be like later in life. However, wanting to be like someone is quite different from wanting to be someone. Wanting to be like someone means you admire some specific characteristics in them. But wanting to be someone is spurred by envy. If a person wants to be you, then he or she has an ulterior motive. They probably want to drag you down and take your position. For instance, you take a photo on social media that got many likes, a person who wants to be you would go to any length to get that same clothing and also strike that exact pose to get more likes and shares than you did. If you notice anyone around you with such behavior or any related attitude, then you should avoid them entirely. They mean no good. 9. Pessimist It can't be done. It's unrealistic. You'll fail and embarrass yourself. Don't even try, says a pessimistic individual. The continuous litany of negativity that flows from the mouth of this person can slowly persuade even the determined optimist that they will never succeed. These people don't just complain or down-talk you. They lie with a misguided certainty that they, you and everyone around them will fail and that it's better not to begin in the first place. These people will never make attempts to move forward because they believe that if they do, they will trip and fall. And if you spend your time with them, neither will you. Even if you don't adopt their negative ways, you will begin to doubt yourself. You may begin to reason if the risk involved in chasing your dreams are worth it. The pessimist often claims to be a realist, but the fact is that their beliefs about the world are based on its uncertainties, but that it is nothing but a dark fairy tale. The sooner you entirely avoid these people, the better for you. 10. Ignorant individuals Ignorant people are not uneducated people, or even people who aren't as educated as you are. They are not people who don't have a particular set of skills or talents. Ignorant individuals are not mentally invalid. They are fine, and their minds are just as valid and potentially transformative as your own. They may even be more educated than you are. However, these individuals are close-minded people who, because of ego, self-righteousness, are unwilling to adopt to changes and learn. Ignorant people work in absolutes. They think things should only be done one way, or that change is never a good thing. They are stuck up in their old beliefs and often refuse to learn from their mistakes, even when the facts are presented to them. If you have such people in your life who never listen to the opinions of others, then you should altogether avoid them before they transfer their ignorance to you. You may decide to continue being in touch with these people, but be sure not to allow them to drain you or contaminate your life. In the words of Hans F. Hansen, people inspire you or they drain you. Pick them wisely.